Hey guys, welcome back to Sarah Abbott Life Coaching. My name is Sarah Abbott, I'm the life coach here. This is video four in my um, video series, how I lost 50 pounds with the Enneagram. And today we're gonna talk about enjoying your life. The key to making life change is enjoying the results when you do the work. I know I experienced that. I went to therapy for many years and now I get to experience the fruits of that labor, uh, which for me was a much happier marriage, much happier. You guys, we did marital therapy and I don't know how anyone can be married without a marriage counselor, but we did the work and now we reap the benefits. And the same is true in your own life with whatever you're stuck on. Do the work, enjoy your life. So I wanna just share with you how being down 50 pounds and at my goal is allowing me to enjoy my life more. Gosh, you guys, it's so good. All right, so before I begin, I want to say that I believe I will eat Trim Healthy Mama. I just have to eat it forever, and I like it, so that's not a sacrifice. I, In fact, I wouldn't even change because it just works. It's so kind of fun. I like it. Um, I like the routine. I like all of it. So I'm not like going off a diet because guess what? If I go back to my old eating, I will be old Sarah and old Sarah was 50 pounds heavier and I don't wanna do that. So I want to say the main thing I think is different is that I feel free. For 12 years of getting fatter, 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 I was obsessed with being overweight. And even if I wasn't taking action on it, I was thinking about how miserable I was being overweight and how scared I was that it kept getting worse. And now I am freed to think about other things. I just am so grateful for that. Secondly, I mentioned this in the last video, but I love beauty, I love style, I love fashion. And I love that now when I shop for clothes, um, when I was, you know, severely overweight. I just picked clothes that were potato sacks that would cover my fat. Now I can wear clothes that make me feel beautiful. And that is a big difference. Um, and I'm just really grateful for that too. Okay, I am forcing myself to live boldly. Here's one thing I told myself for the three years I was losing. Actually, I've told myself this for the last 15 years. I told myself, Sarah, back in your 20s when you were at your goal weight, I still felt fat. You know what, how young women do that? Like no matter what they look like, they feel fat. And I held myself back from wearing a bikini or whatever. Well, I, for 15 years of being fat and losing the weight, I was like, Sarah, when you get to your goal, you're gonna live your life and you're gonna know you're not fat and that's good. So now I'm at my goal and I'm forcing myself to do it. So this summer, I worked so hard, I reached my goal. And I live in California and it's just hot. It's hot as like, surface of the sun. So I wear a lot of sundresses and you know, I have to tell you, I do slow jog and like maybe once a month I do <laughs> like bicep curls, <laughs> but that's about it. And so my arms are still flabby. They're very flabby now because there's like, you know, I don't know, like I lost the weight, which can cause some kind of like, uh, I don't know, loose skin, I guess. So I was like, oh darn still not thin enough or fit enough or whatever, toned enough to wear a sundress confidently. And I was like, that's BS. So I changed my mindset and I was like, Sarah, you worked hard to look this way. Show your arms. If people don't like them being flabby, people can suck it. That's the gift of the Enneagram 8, to tell you people can suck it. It's one of our blessings. <laughs> anyway, I showed off my arms all summer and it was kind of a challenge because they're not Michelle Obama arms. They are Sarah Abbott Norwegian arms and that can be pretty sad looking, but I don't care because I worked really hard to look this way and I'm proud of the work I did and I will not let any part of my body hold me back anymore. That's freedom. Okay, this might be too much information for you, but one of the benefits of losing 50 pounds is that your sex life is better because sex involves touching <laughs> and people touching me when I was fat, people, who am I talking about? This is my husband. Um, touching me when I was fat was horrible. I hated it because I just feel how fat you are when someone's touching you in your you know, waist, in your nightgown. Ew, and so now I enjoy our sex life a lot more and I'm more relaxed and I don't care if he touches my waist. 
Okay, that was probably too much information, but I don't care. All right. Nice thing about being an Enneagram 8 is I literally don't care what anyone thinks about me, so I can just say things very boldly and not worry about it. Okay, I am more confident. Another perk, uh, which is hard to say. Enneagram 8s have an unnatural self-confidence as it is. I was pretty confident overweight, but now I am really confident. And I feel so, hmm, changed because I tackled this mountain of weight that I honestly at times despaired I couldn't actually lose all 50 pounds, but I did it. And I'm telling you, reaching your goals is intoxicating because it's like, if I can do that, I can do anything. That's exciting. Okay, um, what about relief? Oh, I feel so relieved. So I was at my niece's birthday party and you know, people are snapping photos and they put it on the family online photo album. And my first reaction was like, oh, I'm gonna look so fat because for 12 years when people, lovingly took photos of me <laughs> and put it on a Facebook or an online photo album. I was like, oh, holy cow, Sarah, how did you let it get so bad? You look terrible. But I looked at the photo and I was like, oh damn, I look girl. I look good. <laughs> oh, that is a relief. I am no longer living in fear of people posting photos of me and that feels really good. I'm enjoying my life. That's the fruit of the labor. That's why it's worth doing the work. If you are ready to get unstuck and do your work, you can go to sarahabbottlifecoaching.com, book your free 30 minute discovery session. You can ask me anything. As you can tell, I speak frankly, I'll tell you the truth. And if you wanna work with me, I think it would be really exciting. And I believe people can get the life that they dreamed of. And maybe that is what you need is that encouragement. If you like this video, please press like. If you wanna subscribe, that would be amazing. And then you'll know YouTube will tell you when the next video posts. The next video is gonna be a recap of this whole weight loss series. And I'm gonna introduce the next story um, that I'm gonna tell on this life coaching page, which is gonna be really exciting. Thank you for joining me. Take care.